Hey folks, welcome to Fiddlehead Fiddle Lessons. Let's learn an Irish waltz called She Beg and She More by Turlo O'Carroll. So, this tune was written by Turlo O'Carolan. He was an Irish harper, lived a couple hundred years ago. He was influenced by a lot of the classical and Baroque music of the time. So you, you can kind of, his tunes all have a little bit of that flavor to them, which I like. So this is a waltz and it's in the key of D major. So I recommend warming up the D major scale. <laughs> doing waltz rhythms like triplets or melodic variations that that are triplet patterns like the one two three variation just a nice warm-up method to get you in the mood of the the feeling of the tune the rhythm of the tune uh, I call these that particular melodic variation, uh, one, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. And I teach a bunch of these and have lessons on them if you're interested. So now I'll just get into the tune and I'm gonna start with the A part and just break it down for you. Here is the first quarter of the A part. down even further. By the way, this is a four bar section with a little pickup. And then with flow again. In the second bar, you could use fourth finger if you feel comfortable with it. And if you don't, you could use open E. If you do know fourth, that's probably the most natural thing to do in that place. All right. So now let's move on to the second quarter of the A part. break that down further. So it's kind of an awkward place to end, but that last note feels like a pickup to what comes next. So I'll just do it again more quickly with flow. Okay, and then moving on to the third quarter, the A part. So breaking that down, starting A1. And now the fourth quarter. So it starts the same as the third chord. Let's break it down for the left hand fingering. All right, now I 
think I'll just slowly play the entire A part to put it together for you. One, two, three. Let me try again. One, two, three. B part, I'll just say that if you really learn the A part well, a lot of the ideas are repeated in the B part. Mainly a lot of the rhythms of long, short, long, short, long, short, long. And, and then kind of a similar thing with, with quarter notes and eighth notes, that was half notes and quarter notes um, would be a Long, short, short, long, long, short, short, long. Okay, so anyhow, I'm gonna now play the first quarter of the B part for you very slowly. So breaking it down further for the left hand, And then more quickly. Okay, so moving on, let's do the second quarter of the B part. I'm going to start with a pickup. down for left hand fingering. Let's move on to the third quarter of the B fart. that broken down. Finally, the fourth quarter of the B part, starting with the pickup note. down for left hand fingering. And with flow. So I'm going to do the whole B part for you in a sec, but it just occurs to me that one thing you can do to really prepare for this that really I should have mentioned at the beginning of the lesson is to just play some of these rhythms on an open string. Like... Which is the same rhythm as the beginning of the B part. basic long, short, long, short, even do these on scales like long, short, long, short, long, short. All right, let's now do the whole B part.
Okay, so if you've been learning vibrato, this would be a good tune to try it on because there's all these nice long notes like In general, vibrato on longer notes makes more sense. If you're playing really fast, it gets lost and maybe just ends up sounding like warbling. But for long, longer notes, it's a real chance to milk those long notes. And if you want to learn vibrato, I've got a bunch of lessons on that on the Fiddlehead YouTube as well as on the site. There's actually a lot more on the site with carefully broken down exercises for you. Anyhow, love this tune and if you love it too and learn it and play it, let me know. Make a video of yourself playing it and share it or something. I don't know. And it's good hanging out with you as usual and we'll see you next time. Go to fiddlehead.com for a progressive step-by-step -step course outline, color-coded tabs, play-along tracks, sheet music, and much more. Thanks for watching the video club. Excellent. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.